What's wrong? It's okay. It's okay. It's just a high chair. Jasmine, sit down, please. I want to sit on a high chair. Yeah, okay. I'll switch over in a second when I get you dressed. It's okay. You can sit there. Sit there. Can I help you sit there? No, it's okay. You can sit there. I want to sit there. It's okay. It's okay. Isabella, you can sit there. It's okay. You can sit there. It's a high chair. That's a high chair and that's a high chair. I want to get out. Okay, I'll get you out. I want to get out and get into a high chair. You're in a high chair. No, I want that high chair. You want that high chair? Yeah. Why can't you just sit in that one? It's the same thing. I want that high chair. I want that high chair. Okay, okay, I'll get you changed. I'm going to get Jasmine changed now anyway. Okay. I want to get up and sit in Isabella's high chair. You want to sit in Isabella's high chair? Yeah. I want to, Bobby. It's okay, Isabella. I want to sit in Isabella's high chair. So there you go. That's the, uh, the OCD of an autistic child. Um, it's, it's so bad. Even the littlest things um, will set her off. Like just... There's two high chairs, and because she normally sits in the other high chair, if I put her in that high chair, she just freaks out. Like that's how different when, like when different things happen, how much she freaks out when it happens. It's really bad. Like she, anything different, anything different whatsoever. Like we're still in our own house and everything like that. Just because it's in, she's in a different chair, she freaks out. So I just thought I'd show a clip of the. Isabella, her autistic OCD coming out. Um, oh. It's okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Mine, put a little bit band on. A little bit band aid. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. Mommy. Mommy, are you hold Jasmine? Park. Do the park? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe a bit later. Mike? You better stop. Oh, stop. guys so we're home now um we just went back down to the doctor to get jasmine's um hand redressed uh they said we don't have to go back for a couple of days now so we leave it like that for a couple of days make sure it doesn't get wet um and then in a few days we'll go back and go check it out they said it's healing quite well uh then we went from there we went to get her two year health check done at the Blue Book place with the nurses, the community nurse, um, to get the Blue Book filled out. I don't know if everybody knows what Blue Book is. It's these books that we get when, um, I'm not sure what that happened then. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a Blue Book for all the kids' health records. We get that when our kids are born at the hospital and then every couple of months Every year you get them checked out, their ears, their eyes, their motor skills, their speech, all that. Um, so yeah, that's all done. We're just home. Kids are playing outside, just putting some shopping away. That's it. What happened? What happened, Anthony? What happened? She, she jumped on top of me and she smashed my head into the wall. <laughs> hey, no, 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 no hitting. <laughs> oh, we have twins. Twins, good girl. Can you say twins? <laughs> twins. I want to do it. I want to do it. Back at the doctor's again. 
today for the second time today. <laughs> because Anthony is sick. He has lost his voice. Okay, say hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. Yes, so we came here earlier for Jasmine to the different medical center for Jasmine for her hand and now we're back here again for Anthony who has lost his voice and it sucks because his job is to sell things like over the phone and he obviously can't make any sales if he doesn't have a voice so that sucks but um what's that? I'm pretty good at my job as well. You are. He makes a lot of sales. It's good because he, he gets a um, base salary, but he also gets commission. And his commission is actually more than his base. So it's all right. He's doing pretty good lately. Um, I forgot to say before about Jasmine's um, appointment. She's doing really good. They aren't worried about anything at all. Um, they, they did a height and weight. Her height... Her weight is in the 85th percentile, my 12 and a half kilo baby. And she's 85 centimeters tall, which is in the 50th percentile. Um, so she's doing really good. They're not really worried about anything about it. Any of her um, developmental problems. So that's good. She's doing really well. Do you know what it's like? <laughs> um, we also did Isabella's height and weight while we were there just to just to see and it was actually um, Jasmine careful come no I don't want you walking along the chairs <laughs> off no don't don't no 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 sit down please sit down and get off the chair off the chair off no, Jasmine, you're not going to walk along the chairs. You're going to fall and hurt yourself, baby girl. No. Um, yes, yeah, Isabella is 16 kilos and 105 centimeters tall, um, which it's put her in the 23rd percentile. So it's all right. It's better than um, when she was a baby. She was in the 5th percentile. So um, yeah, so it's better than than what she was as a baby, I guess. <laughs> Come here. Dad! Dad So we're sitting here waiting for Anthony to get the, uh, his antibiotics. He's got an argument and... What is that argument for? Because he has a chest infection. And he's also got asthma. So all four of us at the moment have got asthma and chest infections. I mean, the girls have only got asthma, and but I've got a chest infection and asthma, and Anthony's got chest infection and asthma, so we all have asthma at the moment. It's coming from that house, so we've really got to move. <sighs> this sucks. But a house, you wouldn't think that a house could actually bring on a sickness, but obviously it can. It's an old house. It's an older style house that we're renting, so. Just got to get out of there, get into a newer house, and we should all get better, hopefully. So we're home now. This one's telling me she's tired. So we're just having some cuddles on the lounge while dinner gets cooked. Um, just having something easy tonight. Anthony is over there filling in some applications on the computer. Peace! <laughs> Sorry about my voice. <laughs> He's just filling in some applications for some houses over there. Um, because we really got to go, like, now. Can't believe all four of us have asthma. It's shocking. But anyway, hopefully we get a place and we can move soon. And, um... <coughs> then, yeah, we'll, we'll be happy and healthy. All right. Uh, please thumbs this. <laughs> Good girl. Are you gonna say bye? Yeah. Please thumbs up this video and subscribe, and we'll talk to you guys later. Bye. You say bye. I want to say bye.
You want to say bye too? Yes. Okay, come on. Come and say bye. Bye. Say bye. Bye. So what did you do today? <sighs> no, you don't want to say what you did today? No. No? No. You want to say bye? Bye. You say bye? Bye. Alright, see you guys.